2020 in MotoGP. I still can't believe it, honestly, because uh, I need probably a couple of hours to understand a bit the situation, because now I'm a bit like in shock. All the year with a lot of pressure is uh, unbelievable to how we manage the situation. And uh, finally we, we get the, that title. No? When I saw the, the board with the world champion, I said, this is not happening to me. And I started to cry. Uh, then when I saw the, the people, uh, I was crying also. And, uh, and then doing the lap, uh, I started to to realize what, what was happening. Joan did an incredible, an incredible season. I saw him this year very, very constant. A lot of podiums, a lot of uh, good races. So I'm so happy for him, for Suzuki, in his 100th anniversary, uh, getting the, the MotoGP World title. It's, it's unbelievable. Unbelievable because we couldn't we couldn't imagine something better like this, you know. And congratulations and thanks very much to all the team staff and uh, the, the engineer in Japan. They working so hard. All the people at home, even in Italy, in Japan. And uh, this is our sixth season since we we restarted at Suzuki. And uh, yeah, to be here is amazing. I couldn't realize that uh, we can take a championship or not, but of course we try harder, then it was a very difficult way, but little by little our performance and the rider performance improved, and thanks for everybody uh, help us, then finally we achieved it. And the first Suzuki rider to do it in 20 years. They deserve it because they made an awesome job, not this year. All the, all the previous year, and congratulations to them, to all the people that uh, is working at, uh, in, uh, in Japan, in Hamamatsu, uh, making this, uh, this uh, bike uh, even faster and even better. I'm so happy to be that guy who brings uh, Suzuki again back on top 20 years uh, later.